Any other public comment? Any other general public comment? Yeah, there's a lot of weird stuff that happened at that meeting last week. So not only did you uh, say that the topics weren't germane, but then you went ahead and allowed them to bully you into allowing them to speak. Whereas, uh, you know, the, you did the opposite of that when, when I tried to, to speak as well. So my name is Dr. Justin Spies. Uh, there were a couple articles that were just written uh, today, one from the Kansas Reflector, one from the Lawrence Times talking about a lawsuit that I filed against the city commission here uh, and Lisa Larson and Courtney Shipley and, um, and also the city library. And I just want to encourage everyone out there to uh, you know, go, and, go and read the, uh, if you're interested, go, go and read the complaint. It's a public record. And I encourage you to do that just so you get the facts because, you know, like when you read Lawrence Times and Kansas Reflector, you're not going to get the whole story. So the story is in the, in the complaint. You know, for example, you know, the Lawrence Times uh, neglected, you know, part of it is uh, one of the things uh, that Courtney Shipley did is said that I, I couldn't clap during a meeting. I mean, I mean, just think of that. You know, talk about being a tyrant. So we got one human being telling another human being he can't take his hands and do this with them. But another group of human beings you guys allow to take their hands and go like this because you approve of it. So last week at the meeting after everyone spoke on the issue that you said wasn't germane, Lisa Larson, but allowed them to speak, not only did you allow them to speak on it, you allowed them to clap on it as well. So I don't understand how, how they got to clap and and, and why, I, why I didn't get to, to clap. So, you know, that's in the lawsuit. That's restricting my First Amendment. It's also compelling speech. I mean, because think of the opposite of that. So everyone there, you know, clapped in support of pro-Israel and clapped on all these topics. And when I went up and spoke, nobody clapped. Well, I don't give a shit about that, but the opposite of that would be that if you all sat up there, or there were people like me, right, our, our scary Republicans sat up there and told them that they had to clap when I spoke about stuff that, that they didn't agree with. It's the same thing, but it's, it's you know, it's not equally applied. So, uh, and it's, you know, I th it's just so, I mean, it's so, uh, I think the word it is like, petty tyranny, you know? It, it, it's not a petty issue, but you're just being so petty. I couldn't clap. Are you kidding me? Why? <laughs> so anyways, that lawsuit's out there. Maybe we'll find out why I couldn't clap. I got my suspicions. I have my hunches, and I, and I think a lot of people already know. But uh, all right, check out that. If you can't find it online, just shoot me an email. My email address on my YouTube channel, the Dreaded Rabble Rousers. Check it out. Any other 